Hey, 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 hey! Don't step on the dice! There a reason you're interrupting our game, Horkface? Don't know any brawn old. Don't know you. Either way, I got nothing to tell you. Get lost. I'm on a winning streak. Dead? That's a new one. Nothing Kasala usually moves through port is worth killing over. You didn't hear it from me, but she's the one picking up those shipments. Her warehouse is down on the docks. You want to know more? Go ask her. Morfrey, is that you? Listen closely, you insufferable clod. I need you to buy my notes and... Uh, wait, you're not Porfrey. I can tell from the lack of heavy breathing and sniffles. Who are you? Stuck in the bottle? No, no, no. This is a devious and very stubborn illusion. One that you now have the privilege of breaking. I was conducting some research, you see, and inadvertently triggered this spell. <laughs> Luckily, I know how to reverse it. It's quite simple. I recorded the locations of three verses of a powerful incantation in my journal on the off chance something like this occurred. Acquire the verses, come back and dispel this illusion. I'll make it worth your while, I promise. Must be Mog. Questions? I have questions. Happy to oblige. Buy a few rounds and let's chat. You're going to answer me, Orc, or. Hey! Nobody intimidates my friends. Princess Savannah? Oh. Who gave you the right to walk in here and bully my friend? Did my father send you? Because he doesn't like Mog. But I like Mog. Mog doesn't care that I'm a princess, and it doesn't matter to me that Mog's a scoundrel. If my father didn't send you, why are you threatening my friend? Smelly bastards. Cheap, too. Wouldn't buy us a drink. They hung their flyers and left without saying a word. Then, a different smelly bastard showed up to sign on workers. He was a charmer, though. <laughs> His breeches fit well, and he was handsome. Not a Nord. Breton, maybe. I didn't really listen to what he was saying. A half dozen workers left with him. Off to the Drudok Mountains or someplace. He hasn't been back since. Let's talk outside, partner. You look like you had a rough expedition, friend. But we in the Undaunted don't sign up to sit on cushions and drink mead, do we? Mordra can answer that better, and probably more to the point than I can. Basically, we're adventurers. You look like you'd fit in well. You've got that fearless look about you the Undaunted are known for. Keep away from me! What? You want to face me in a tribute match? You're getting ahead of yourself. Rank up. Then I'll consider it. Looking for a game of tribute, right? Well, I can't promise a challenge. All we can do is our best, right? 
I'm afraid you need a few more notches in your belt before you can face me. Raise your rank a bit, then we'll talk. So we've got a mysterious Breton possibly working with Reachmen, recruiting workers for some unknown purpose. Plus, there's a smuggler hiding unknown contraband in a warehouse down by the docks. I say we deal with the smuggler first. We know where to find her, and we more or less know what she's up to. And if the two are connected, maybe the smuggler can help us narrow our search for the Breton. Ready to visit Casella's warehouse? <laughs> 